is Justin from Horsepower Obsessed, uh, beautiful Corvette ZR1. Um, it is back in finally to get the Expel Fusion Plus coating installed. Um, the vehicle was in here a couple weeks ago to get the Expel paint protection film installed on the vehicle. Um, and now it's finally back in to get the remaining bits uh, polished and corrected um, and the Fusion coating applied to everything. Um, we're also going to do a wheels off coating on this vehicle. So we're going to take the wheels off the car so we can coat the face barrel the back of the spokes as well as clean up those calipers and coat those as well. Um, the coating is going to offer a bunch of gloss and depth um, to all the panels, even the panels that have the um, film on them, um, as well as make it a lot easier to clean them um, and protect them against like bug etchings, um, bird droppings and different things like that. Um, so walking around the vehicle a little bit, um, I already went ahead and prepped the vehicle as far as washing it, doing an iron decontamination on it, cleaning the wheels, and claying the vehicle to remove any uh, contaminants that are stuck on there. Um, so once that was already done, um, I went over all the panels and went over them with a LED light to pull out any main imperfections that really need focused on more than others. Um, and coming around the vehicle here, I just marked a couple with a piece of tape. Um, that way we can kind of show you what's going on. Um, so on the roof here, um, this is carbon fiber. Um, we do have a little bit of hologramming going on in this general area um, here. Um, and this can be from anything that could have happened at the port or at the dealership itself, um, where they actually just go over it with a rotary. And those rotaries, they spin in one direction and one direction only. And when they're going over, if you're using like a wool pad or anything like that, it can tend to leave um, what are called rotary marks behind. Um, and this um, carbon fiber roof is definitely showing that. Um, so moving back here a little bit more, um, on the back side of the hatch area, um, we have a little bit of a wet sand mark going on. This could have been a defect at the factory whenever they were painting it, um, or anything that could have happened at port. Um, so this is going to get taken care of as well. Um, on the spoiler here, we also have some holograms going on from a rotary. Um, and then back on this far corner, um, on the other side of the um, hatch area, we have a clear coat imperfection. So it looks to be like a little bit of overspray from clear coat, um, but that's an area where it's kind of hard to see, but it is thoroughly marked that way. I can pay attention to that area. Um, that way it's looking like glass, like, like the rest of the vehicle. Um, and then coming down the passenger side of the car, um, we do have another wet sand mark on the um, passenger side door. Um, that's another area that's gonna be focused on to make sure that is in tip top shape before the coating gets installed. Um, because we want to make sure the paint is as perfect as possible prior to putting the coating on because the coating is just going to seal everything in um, and it's going to make it a lot easier for you to see any imperfections in the vehicle. Right, so up here on the um, carbon fiber roof of the uh, ZR1, we see some of the holograms going on here. Um, it's not just in this section, it kind of spreads over the entire roof, um, but I just have it marked here. Um, that way I remember that it's on the whole roof. Um, so you can kind of see what we got going on here. I don't know if the camera's gonna be able to pick it up, um, but definitely got a little bit of haziness going on here. All right, so back here on the hatch area of the Corvette, um, we see a factory wet sand mark going on right here it's like right at this angle um, so that's going to be something definitely important to get taken care of um, because that is very visible I mean it's not just visible by this light but I can actually see it outside in the natural light um, so it's definitely something we're going to want to get taken care of all right so on the other side of the hatch um, towards the passenger side rear quarter panel um, we have what looks to be a little bit of clear coat overspray. Um, again, this could be something that happened from factory because there is like a dead set straight line um, at the end of it. Um, so this is definitely something else that's going to have to be removed. 
And here we are on the passenger side door. Um, you can see another pretty visible um, wet sand mark going on right here. Um, so we are going to pin correct that and remove that one can as you well. Again? Hi, my name is Patrick. Um, I am the nano coating specialist here at Blackout Tinning. Um, here we have Justin's um, Corvette ZR1. Um, this vehicle was in a couple weeks ago to get the Expel uh, paint protection film applied to a couple different areas. Um, and it actually came back now to get a paint correction and the Expel Fusion Plus coating. Um, what's great about Fusion Plus is the coating goes on everything. So not only does it go on the areas that are not protected with film, but it goes on top of the areas that are protected with film. Um, so this vehicle got the Fusion Plus coating, which is a four-year warranty coating. Uh, it went everywhere on the painted surfaces, it went on the glass, the plastics, all the carbon fiber bits. Um, and then for the wheels, uh, the wheels were a little bit different. Um, we actually took the wheels off the vehicle. That way we could do the face, barrel, back of the spokes, as well as the brake caliper, which will make it easier for him to clean. Um, but walking around the vehicle, it came out really, really well. Um, it's much more glossier than it was before, which is one of the greatest enhancements of ceramic coatings. Um, and I think out here in the sun, whenever the sun's coming in and the sun's going out, um, it's definitely a very vibrant color and it's looking amazing right now. If you have any more questions regarding ceramic coatings, um, you can reach us here at Blackout Tinning. Um, all of our info and how to get a hold of us is going to be in the description below.